In the upper left hand corner you can see a console window where the Node.js server prints status messages. In the lower left hand corner you can see a sample file that we'll be uploading. And then in the middle on the right hand side you can see a web app. You can see the Watson Assistant chat bot there on the right and you can see the file upload widget in the middle. So if we drag a sample file onto the upload widget, you can see in the status messages that the web app has saved the file on the Node.js server in an uploads directory. And then the Node.js server turns around and sends that file on to Cloud Object Storage. You can see that in the status message. Once it's in Cloud Object Storage, the Node.js server returns a success response to the web app. And then the web app sends a message to the chatbot you can see in the blue bubble. Basically, it's a, a special kind of message that indicates a file is ready in Cloud Object Storage. And on the chatbot side, you can see that we've used an entity to recognize that we received that special a file has been uploaded to Cloud Object Storage message. And then we use a regular expression to extract the key to get the file from storage and to extract the original file name so we can display that for the user. And then the chatbot calls a webhook to go off and process that file in Cloud Object Storage. Back in the web app here, we can see the status messages that the chatbot is printing. It's saying, yes, we've received that uploaded file. Now we're gonna call the webhook and then presumably the webhook does some stuff and returns a response.